This is 93 quick, fast seconds on the complexity of 1993. The Chronic, I mean, The Chronic was just, it was, a, it was more than an album. It, it almost changed just culture in general. I mean, just number one, the, the, music, the music was phenomenal on the album, the production from Dre, you know, um, the Dog Pound, Snoop Dogg, you know, it was, it was kind of Snoop Dogg's coming out party, you know what I'm saying? Um, it just kind of changed culture, I mean, and it was accepted nationwide. Midnight Marauders, I mean, that album, just me being a musician and also just doing a lot of jazz stuff, uh, digging in records, like I said, that album was kind of like, just like the, the holy grail of, of production and hip hop. I mean, the samples that they used. And Wu-Tang, it was just, whew, end of the 36. I remember seeing, I don't know if it was an Arsenio Hall episode or it was a, it might have been Young TV Raps, where they was like all on TV and they was like standing on a chessboard. And you know, you had Ghostface with a thing over his face and then of course you had ODB. And it, visually it was just like, these are some crazy motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? Like, what is this? But they was just so hard, the harshness of it, the grittiness of the production. Uh, it was almost like watching a, a game where you know, just come at you head, head on, but with lyricism. Boom, that was 93 seconds of your life. You want to make your life? Come to Classic Hip Hop.